Hello, hello to all the amazing people. Doniemer here with the second part of our Hokma realization. The first part was kind of easy, a little bit lengthy, but uh, pretty easy in general. So finally, the Angela decided, okay, it's not enough uh, helping you out. Oh, that's... And uh, it's time to fight. It's time to fight. Oh, yeah, interesting. Reverence. So we're getting staggered here like crazy. Okay, let's see what she has. Paradise lost. 666666, okay. Emotion coins. The time has come. Uses the combat page, rise and serve me on the first scene. Starting with the third scene, uses the combat page, I am thy savior, every three scenes. Rise my servants, rise and serve me. Summons two guardian apostles on the second scene. Okay. Staff Apostle, undying, suspended, becomes indefinitely staggered if HP falls to 2 or lower. Can only recover from stagger when Paradise Lost uses a combat page that resurrects the Apostle. I will follow the offensive dice gain plus 2 power against the Librarians with Revelation. What's Revelation? I don't know. So this is like a fate encounter, I guess. Rise and serve me, the Patron Librarian cannot redirect this page. On use, targeted librarian dies at the end of scene. Wait, what? That's BS. Why? Why would you do this to me, game? On news, targeted librarian dies at the end of the scene. I don't think there's any way we can save, save it. I'm gonna lose two people here. That pisses me off. That's not fun. Um, like for real now. I have to choose two people to lose? <laughs> Give one strength, endurance and haste to a random ally next scene. Are we gonna have to fight our own people now? Is that what we are doing here? Oh boy. Oh no, actually, like... There we go. So when we only lose one person, I guess uh, <laughs> we have three <laughs> three things on him, though. Uh, I'm afraid, though, that rise and serve me. This sounds like it's gonna resurrect on her side. I really don't wanna fight a whole bunch of mass attacks. I don't wanna fight this thing. PD I like so much and obviously Hokma cannot redirect it so <sighs> hard decisions who do we who do we sacrifice here I don't know Why did I give Alan the these? <laughs> uh... <laughs> Target LeBron dies at the end of the scene. Like, did we get any cards that can prevent that? No, I don't think so. That's just it. You lose the person. This is really good. Becomes indefinitely staggered. So that's like for penance. All allies gain one strength. So we get a permanent one strength from penance. But if we lose 
him, then we don't. Uh, I guess we could give up PD instead. I just feel like PD is so much more powerful than Alan is. I just don't want to give this up, basically. Ah, this hurts, this hurts. <laughs> this hurts a lot. Um, why did I give Nikolai? <laughs> Could have been Nikolai instead. <laughs> you have two... Ah, oh, these are not so good, right? Dylan take twice as much stagger damage on the flag. Who are we going to sacrifice? The messenger. <laughs> I'm so afraid of Tao Chie. <sighs> Damn it. Why did you do this to me, game? I don't want to play this game anymore. I'm just going to shut it off and play something else. This sucks so much. Ah, it has to be. I'm... Yeah, I'm going to give up penance and... The 13th toll here. Okay. Alan, bye-bye. I'm really sorry. Fear though not. Give one strength, endurance and haste to a random ally next scene. Okay. That sucks so much. Blunt Pierce. Okay. Eh. Well you're going for me anyway, right? Wait. Yeah, that one is okay, so we have to Okay, let's put some vapor on it. Oh wait, can we put Vapor? I could put Vapor on, on her. Yeah, that's true. Okay, this is already going for me, so I just need to intercept the other one. If I mess this one up... ...and lose two people, I'll be pissed. Okay, so this these both of these definitely targeting Alan right now. Definitely. There's no like... Okay. Okay, this goes for me. Yeah, well, I guess Alan, you just... Just grab all three of them. Because you're dying anyway, so whatever, right? Okay. <laughs> uh, right. Okay, let's... I don't know. Let's go for these first. Except Vapor. Vapor we might want to put on her. Because Slash is not effective anyway, right? Yeah, it's not. We are on Emotional level 3. I should have leveled her to 5, but you know, if I was smart... What's this? Pierce and Slash, so I can send that here. Okay. And this one's blunt. Okay. Brace up. Alright. Here. Okay. Vapor there. That's good. You. Mm. I feel like switching here. To what exactly, though? I can make her feeble and stuff. So we got 16 charge. I have no smoke though. So maybe we switch to slashing first. Smoke, smoke ourselves up. Graze the grass. Goes here and here. There we go. What do we have? Draws one page. There we go. Draw page. Fine. And you. 
Okay, so we are attacking this one with quite a lot. Do you have any blunt attacks, maybe? I don't think you do, right? Ooh, smoke smash, right. Uh, plus two enduring. Yeah, I need to, like, dodge some attacks here. Mm. Smoke nine, so six, eight. Yeah, let's go for that. Uh, we're full. We can, like... Oh, that's actually blunt. There we go. Do that. Like that. Okay, you. Slash it there. Yeah, blunt there. That's good. Uh, how are you doing? Well, we can recharge with that. I don't probably want to draw some cards as well. Okay, most importantly, these two go to Alan. Bye-bye, Alan. I'm really sorry. Okay, that was some nice stagger recovery there. Wait, we're actually doing damage to her. The true trigram formation. I forgot to use the trigram page. Not that it matters. It's not like we could have killed her on the first turn and protected Alan. Sucky sucky. I hate it. <laughs> Can't believe game would do this to you. Like, is there any way to prevent that? I don't think it is. It says on use, so... As long as she plays it, and she will, there's really nothing we can do. Maybe there's hope, maybe we can get it back somehow. How? I don't get it. Why? Why did we lose PD there? Like, I checked like 10 times. Somebody explain it to me, please. <sighs> oh well. To say I'm pissed would be an understatement by a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Uses the combat page, rise and serve me on the first scene. Starting with the third scene, uses the combat page, I'm thy savior. Right, so. Flick to bleed. Seal a speed die of target for the next scene. What did I mess up? I don't think I messed up. I think it was just scripted that we lose two people. Or maybe he got killed? What, do, what sense does that make? Did I intercept it by accident? I might have intercepted it by accident. Okay. Uh, that's super silly if I did, but I targeted the third one, I think, with both slashes. Did I intercept it? Doubts in my head, doubts in my head, doubts in my head. Well, I still have three pretty good characters, but it sucks. These are pretty fast, wait. Anyone attacking her anyway? Mm, well, you are. Oh, that's kind of bad. Let's draw some cards here. And let's... I don't know if somebody wants strength. I guess we just defend with the Algory Kick here. There we go. And then we brace. There. Pissed. 
On hit, destroy target's next die. Seal speed out target for the next scene. Okay. Where is this going? Okay, I just think we're just gonna defend with vapor here. How do we even kill this thing? Protect at 10. Well, I guess we have to wait for her to play that thing. Okay, this goes here. We're gonna get our die sealed. That's fine though. And this one goes there. Inflict two bleed and stuff. Okay, we can stir the defend it. No problem. Uh, inflict four fragile. Uh, it's getting worse and worse here. Uh, I'm just gonna do some of that. And you. Vapor. And hello back people. So something really bad happened. Uh, my recording software crashed, uh, but I didn't notice. So by the time I was done with the fight, uh, yep, lost my recording. Uh, so the first part of the fight that you just saw uh, is like my first try. And now um, uh, I I started the fight for the second time and I got to the part just before two of my people got killed, I believe. Yep. And it's the same as last time. Also, like no idea what happened. I'm gonna do exactly the same thing I did last time. I'm gonna let this thing go to um, Galena. And I'm gonna intercept this one as well. But I think... I think it's gonna kill both of these once more. So yeah. Anyhow, uh, let's uh, let's see. Let's intercept this one then. Uh, I don't know if it's something. Doesn't really matter. And well, I'm gonna try to keep the commentary relatively similar, like I did the first time. Obviously, I know what's gonna happen now, so I'm not gonna be surprised. But you know. <laughs> Anyhow, so both of these go here, and then since Alan's dying, he's gonna grab all these attacks. It's interesting how like it seems like all the patterns and everything are like, exactly the same. Anyhow, these two are weak to blunt and pierce. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's uh, let's kill them. Let's put some smoke on. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's grab these two as well. So I know dagger press. Oh, this one's weak to pierce, right? Yeah. So dagger press is gonna be good. And I guess I can use concentration here. There we go. So that looks good. That looks good. Oh, fear thou not. Oh, maybe because of that, on you, targeted Labyrinth dies, no. So basically, he is not targeted Labyrinth twice, actually. She's the one being targeted by one of them, even though I intercepted it, which is really weird. <laughs> Let's see if she dies again. Probably will, right? Okay. Uh, let me think, let me think. Let's put some, let's put some Slash on. Although Slash is not the best here. Should I go Blunt instead? I could go Blunt. against this one right there we go oh i think i actually put uh, okay there and raise the grass two reduce the power opens next die by two eight to seventeen how much is zip track six to nineteen but this thing does smoke it up which is like super important i think so Okay, I'm gonna graze the grass. Okay, actually, this is not. Let's do it like this. So it's like at seven. Okay, we need to re change it. I guess I could smoke this one up as well. Nah. It's not. Okay, and then let's graze the grass on this one. There we go. You. Um, we are on level four. Okay, I think that's roughly the same like it was before. Yeah. Uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, so... Mm, well, we have a lot of vapors. Okay, I think this one we're gonna smoke up. Okay, let's do the vapor, like, here. And then some grazes. 
and maybe draw some cards. I don't think we need to draw cards actually. Eh, let's do it anyway. This is slash and blunt. Okay, let's send the slash and blunt here. Let's send that there. Okay. Uh, you. Mm, do we need this one though? Well, it would be nice to give somebody Augury Kick. Oh, actually, Trigrams. Uh, let's see. Gain one strength. Okay, let's do this. And let's play this. Uh, on use all dice in this page, gain plus one power on Gion. Really? Just one power? For that? Gion, yeah. Okay. Oh, I don't want I don't want to get staggered here from this. So we might want to play Smoke Smash. How likely is that to land? Well, it's uh, quite likely actually. Okay, so we're actually gonna Smoke Smash. Let's Smoke Smash this thing, right? So it's like six plus two, eight minimum, right? This thing can still roll nine though. See something. Uh, finishing touch, health howler. Gain one endurance. So we got two endurance. Mm. So in theory, this thing should roll 12 at max, right? Ah, this is fine. This is fine. Let's get some stagger back. Okay. And let's see, do we have any blunt or anything like that? Okay, let's do guidance to get some smoke back and do that. And this was going very exactly, probably there. Okay, and here we can give somebody some strength, I guess. Sure, why not? There we go. And for now, I'm not gonna play anything else, I don't think so. Yeah, let's save it for the next turn, which will be a little bit more difficult. One, two, three, four, eh. I mean, I can play that. This thing is getting hit twice by that, though. That's gonna be, like, a lot of damage. Yeah, I think that's okay. And this thing, yeah. Let's see, let's see if both of them die again. This time, surely they both go for, for Allen. Okay. I think it's scripted that way that you actually lose to people each time either way, so... There we go, Smoke Smash did, did nicely there. Yeah, so two times the toll toils on Alan and... PD is gonna die anyway because, well, game decided that that's how the things are gonna to happen here. And I was like, uh, you know, I was quite surprised by that. As you could see, let's see what happens this time. Probably gonna be the same. <laughs> so much damage. Yeah, I really did not need that much, but you know, better safe than sorry, right? And yum, yum, yum. Oh! It's random? Oh, holy crap! It's random. So if you if you intercept both attacks with same person, she randomly eats somebody. Um, I actually don't know what to say about that right now. <laughs> okay, okay. Anyhow, gonna finish the fight now. I'm like, oh no, we lost two people. Uh, that's really bad. Uh, did they do something wrong? Um. And that's where that's where actually uh, the the tool crashed. So, okay, so we got this, a couple of apostles here that we have to kill ASAP because they're kind of strong. Uh, so let's see. Well, I got vapor, and this one's weak to that. Destroy next die. Seal a speed die of target for the next scene. Okay, we can have one die sealed, I guess. Oh, we can't intercept that at all. Oh, it's actually going for us anyway. So. We can do that. We can try to defend against both of these, I guess, but I don't really have to. And you... Mm, well, this one's kind of weak against Blunt. Blunt's a little bit risky though, isn't it? This is 8. Well, plus 3 strength. 
So 11. We're gonna get ourselves a dialogue here. Oh, wait. Oh. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna go here anyway. There we go. I'm gonna smoke this thing up and try to kill it as soon as we can. Okay, that doesn't do anything good. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna do this. Actually, there we go. And I'm gonna do... I can do that. Yeah. And we'll need some cards. Oof. They're both pretty good against peers. Well, this one at least gets damage, right? Hmm. What about that? Yeah, actually that one needs to be taken care of. There we go. Okay. Uh, 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 blunt and slash. There, I guess. There we go. And there. And smoke blow. Oh, that's fine. And you. Let's see. So the third turn is gonna use... Uh, I am Dice Savior. And we don't know what that is. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go all out here. Well, I know, but uh, I'm gonna pretend like I have no idea what it is. So... Let's see. We're gonna have one light... We're gonna have plenty of light here. We're gonna have some light here. So yeah, we're gonna have enough light to protect against that, whatever it might be. Uh, blunt. Let's go there. And let's go, I don't know, here. Let's get some light back. Cool. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, we're gonna have some dice sealed next round, but that's okay. It is what it is, like Roland would say. Sometimes things don't go as you might want them to go, so and that's okay, that's okay. We're gonna kill these two apostles and then we're gonna try to kill the boss. Damn. We're gonna be like, Angela, calm down, I'm your friend. You need to stop doing whatever you're doing and chill because well it's not good that we all die because of you okay she's like vulnerable now however she's also playing this i am thy savior no you're not you're just being annoying resurrect the suspended apostle next scene inflict a random character damage by this page with revelation next scene right and uh, so yeah this revelation makes some of their attacks stronger if I recall correctly. Uh, give three endurance to Paradise Lost next scene. That's Paradise Lost. Right. So let's protect against seven to seven. Uh, twice. Oh no. This is really bad. We cannot protect here. I guess that's <laughs> why it's a bad idea. Okay. So we got like what? I got one enduring. I got two strengthened. So this thing is like actually like a five and a five. Okay, this thing, 5 and a 4. Hmm. Well, this thing is actually 6, right? Okay, let's protect with the, with that. With the concentration. There we go. And this one's gonna protect... Uh, I can change the stance. If I need to. Uh, let me think... What would be a good way to protect here? I mean, I could just play dual as well, I guess. 6 to 10. Let's see, what could we change into blunting, guarding? Well, guarding stance has some good defenses, right? Doesn't have much damage, though. That's okay. So we're gonna change to guarding stance here. And protect from this thing. So we're gonna play a... Sturdy defense. Yeah, let's go for the boss. Yeah, we need to like do damage. Even though this does only 3 to 6, you know, little by little. Oh, oh, it has defense. Oh, it has 5 protected. Okay, that's okay. That's fine. Okay, we play sturdy defense. We play. I don't know, 
Guidance of the Gears. We play Graze the Grass. We play Energy Conversion. Sure, there we go. And then here, let's draw some cards and let's gain some light. There we go. Oh, we actually need to take care of this thing. Uh, so what is this? Slash and blunt. Slash and blunt, let's see. That's a little bit of blunt right there. Oh. Mm, I should actually put vapor on, on the boss. I should put vapor on the boss. Let's put vapor on the boss. Ah, I see. Okay. So if I defend here with concentration, I I go really slowly with that vapor. But we're gonna get there, right? Yeah, Pierce doesn't do much here though. It might get uh, yeah, it's gonna get staggered by by Okay, where is this going? Okay, good. Let's go. <laughs> Poor Hokma here. That sealed die costed him everything. Well, we still have some staggers, so it's okay. Now we're gonna see what Revelation does as well. So yeah, we... She's gonna resurrect one of the people now, right? And then we, we can like keep killing this one Apostle and keep unleashing on the boss. So everything nice and easy, right? So what act is this? Like second, right? So... Well, I just hope the game is fair enough that we can actually finish with th three people, right? Otherwise, it will be a little bit tricky. Anyhow, we have a person here which is weak to pierce, so we're gonna need some pierce attacks to do it properly. Right, uh, so who's good at pierce? Well, you're good at, v at slash. I could switch the stance here, but I think we changed it recently, yeah, so we can't. Well, concentration has a little bit pierce on it, so... Let's do that. Uh, right. I could start with Graze the Grass and then play Concentration and then. Let's see. Okay, I cannot get Stagger back. Okay, let's see what's Revelation. Reverence. At the end of the scene, take two Stagger damage, lose one stack of this status. Okay, we're fine. Offensive dice of Apostles gain plus two power when engaging Carter with this status. Okay, so we need to. Avoid engaging anything with him here. Okay. Who's gonna go for the boss? Well, I want to go for the boss with some vapors. So we get some nice smoke up and going. Although it is important to kill this thing. So let's see. Sturdy defense. Oh, we can't. What's this? Ah, just let that through and. Yeah, let's just do it like this. There we go. And this thing, we send it there. No. Where do we want to send there? Into the concentration. Okay, I think that's fine. So we're attacking it with quite a few attacks here. Not sure if that's enough though. Wait, I could do sturdy defense? Yeah, it seems better than, uh, than the concentration actually. There we go. Smoke smash. Yeah, this thing needs piercing attacks though. Is this weak? Yeah, it's still weak. Okay, how long will it be weak? Yeah, that's part I don't understand. Why is it fatal? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Vapor the boss. Uh, attack this one with that. Little bit of graze the grass. Little bit of this, little bit of that. Let's go. Pretty easy, right? Yep. I'm gonna destroy Angela here with some nice... Uh, what do you call it? What do you should call it? Some nice vapors, right? Okay, so this thing dies. And it's gonna summon another one in two turns and it's like... Total wreckage here. There we go. Okay. Okay, now it's 
now it's strong against attacks, so we don't have anything smart to do here, really. Um, it has sixes for defense, so anything over six we can attack with. Well, it's enduring, right? So we can still do some damage here, even though it's enduring. But you know, we're really low on charge. So maybe I should play concentration instead. There we go. Well, actually, we could start with Graze the Grass. There we go. And then play Concentration. No, actually, not Graze the Grass. I should start with the Leap. Draw some cards. Then Concentration to get the charge back. And then maybe Graze the Grass to get some light back. And then finally that to get even more light back. Good. With you. So we got some cards now. What's your charge is like full okay so get some of that do that do that oh do that do that i guess we just go in right concentration well we got eight uh energy conversion good concentration Mm, guidance Grace Okay, cool. Let's go It has some nice defenses, but most my things hit stronger than that Nikola is really good. I just have to be careful not to get staggered here though. That's uh, That's one of the dangers that we're facing. So even with endured with all this smoke on we are like still chipping away at health quite uh, lovely, so even in the enduring phase here, we can do quite some quite some damage to keep this phase nice and short. Okay, now she's gonna do the thing again, right? Yep, I am thy savior. Nope, you're not. Uh, okay, let's see what you're gonna defend with. Let's defend. Well, I can also defend with vapor. I mean, one will go through, but I'm gonna get staggered here. If this keeps going like that. Uh, yeah, let's defend with concentration. And let's see. Well, I got some strength. Nah, it's okay. Let's just go. Smoke smash vapor. That's fine. Let's leave some energy there. Okay. Uh, wait. Did I defend? I did. Okay, here we need to defend. We can use sturdy defense to defend. And here I can use also sturdy defense. There we go. Let's get some light back. And here let's also get some... Let's do that and that. There we go. Okay. Can touch this. -da -da -da. Okay, second one's gonna be a little bit nasty here. Ten though, that's good. Concentration doing well. There we go. Sturdy defense. Quite a good card. Well, I knew it was good since I, uh, the moment I saw it, but uh, I didn't use it quite right away because I was playing very aggressive decks. But then at some point. I was like, okay, this is a good thing. Okay, so it's resurrected one of the Apostles here. Okay, oh, it's still Endurance. Okay. Uh, so we need to... Give three Endurance to the Paradise Lost next scene. So it's gonna be very defensive. So we have to be careful about that. Anyhow, we have to kill this thing now. So, And we will, we will. So it's weak against Slashes Slashes. So let's go for that. Well, it would be good. Let's see what you're playing. Oh. I could probably, yeah, let's smoke smash that thing, right? Yeah, let's get some stagger back. And then we can go there, and there, and there, and you. Vapor. Let's take that. There we go. There, and there, and there. And okay, I mean, we can send some into the boss, I guess. Here, 
concentration 16, smoke 8, looking good, looking good. Uh, so anything but pierce, right? I mean, I can switch to like a slashing stance here actually, that's probably a good idea. Vapor, vapor, grace. There you go. And hopefully next uh, next turn the boss is actually there we go, some nice stagger resist, wonderful. Hopefully the next uh, phase boss is finally vulnerable to damage. I did not tr manage to figure out from the from the abilities of the boss when it's like vulnerable and when it's not. Maybe it goes like two turns, yes, two turns, no. I don't know, we'll see soon. I don't think this thing actually managed to play that card, right? Yeah, it didn't. No, it did in the ring, right? Okay, now it's now it's weak. Okay, and yeah, now it's rip for the taking. Well, it does have three endurance, but uh, we're gonna be using some vapors here, so it shouldn't be a big deal. Okay, there we go. Uh, this will probably not go through. But I'll play everything I have anyway. I need some light and cards and stuff, so... Uh, we'll see, we'll see. Two strength, plus two from here. It's actually plus four, so this thing is like... Where is it? So this thing is actually six to eleven. But it's gonna defend for nine. Yeah, that's like... Oh well, what can you do? Uh... Yeah. There we go. And you also vaporize it. Vaporize it, let's go. Guidance and grace. Good. Well, quite a long one, if I might say so myself. Almost here. Oops. Yeah, that's like. Oh, leap actually went through. There we go. Bam! So, what do you have to say now for yourself, Angela? Got beaten second time here. <laughs> Did we... What the heck happened? Everyone staggered. Did we do it wrong? Where did we... Hokma, sir, is there another way we can do this? We ought to keep faith with unwavering resolve. So yeah, all of your characters get staggered and they don't do anything and their boss does a mass summation on use, stagger all librarians, all librarians other than the patron die at the end of the scene. What? Well, so is there some other way we could have done this? Did we miss like a mechanic or something? Well, I don't know. Remove all combat pages from the patron librarian and gave him a special combat page. Wait, what? I didn't get any special combat page. Summon two guardian. Why art thou in fear? All librarians are staggered to the first scene. Uses the combat page. Do not deny me. Do not deny me. Do not deny your god here. Well, let's see what happens. So she's gonna do zero damage to everyone. And everyone dies except Hokma. And Hokma's like... Da -da -dum, pam, pam, pam. There we go. Click to initiate combat. And she does what? Behold my power. 66666666 66 to 66. However, Hokma here is protected 100%. I guess this thing here. Basically, we cannot be killed. And these are just watching. They're watching as their god and savior here is trying to kill Hokma, but well, nothing's happening. So I was really confused the first time around when I came to this part and I was like, oh, okay. So this is like a cinematic. I can't depend on myself anymore. And then we get one card here called Penitence Mass Summation. This page deals a fixed amount of damage, 666 to 666. And apparently it also ignores stagger and protection here. Because this will kill. 
And yeah, that's the fight actually. So basically from the point that my thing crashed, it's all the way easy. Uh, this is all in all a very easy realization actually, like super easy. Way easier than Venus, so I don't know what's up with that. Anyhow, victory. We're gonna watch the exchange of words here. Oh, I'm gonna have to click on it. So let's go. Patron Liberian story, Hokma. Oh, I resent you, Benjamin. I understand, yet I do not. It is unlikely for one's thoughts and interests to perfectly coincide with another's. That may be the reason my mentor and I and the rest of us ultimately failed. I was the one who ruined your plan. Why are you being so compliant with me right now? Could it be that our fates and translations did overlap for once? The Sephiroth may be helping you despite regaining their memories, perhaps because of that. What are your lot? Taking pity on me? One could call it that. To elaborate on this matter in my own words, I believe each one of us is understanding you for different reasons. It helped that we could feel a glimpse of your pain when we were in the light. Don't make me laugh, so it's just a pity wrapped in fancy words. Angela, I am of the belief that sympathy and love are no different from each other. At the end of the day, sympathy motivates one to understand the circumstances of others and reach out to them to make their lives better. How can I not acknowledge it as a form of love? You could call love pity, and you could call pity love at the same time. Well, spoken like a true religious person, I guess. And besides, don't you have sympathy yourself, Angela? You sought at the end of your endeavor to give freedom to all of us who are chained in this cycle. As much as I still envy and hate you to that, we do share a history of being subject to manipulation. Think of it as a small side benefit I happen to be able to grant. You still are awfully dishonest. Anyway, thank you. Okay, so that's that. And then we unlocked some new pages. So we're gonna go through them here. Confession. To be willing to bear pain is half the atonement. All allies fully recover stagger resist and purge all status ailments. Also applies to staggered librarians. For the duration of the reception, take two less stagger damage from attacks. Okay, that seems very powerful, actually. That seems very, very powerful. I like it. Baptism. I shall heal you, curing you of all disease and injury you possess. Add a baptism page to hand, cost 2 and play, return to hand. Target recovers 6 HP and gains 1 endurance this scene. Once per scene. The page is also included in the deck at the start of sus subsequent acts. Uh, wait, what? On play... Oh, we can heal? This is a heal! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is a heal. Wait, what? I like this one. Well, you knew I'm gonna like it. So we can heal people with it. It costs two, that's true. But... Heal. Oh, that's so good. I like this one a lot. Ah, oh, I like it. Advent. I am death and life, darkness and light. For the duration of the reception, restore one additional light at the start of the scene. If the selected librarian also has the abnormality page Baptism, its effect is enhanced. Target recovers 12 HP and gains 2 endurance this scene. What? Restore one additional light? That's nice, I like it. Sentinel. Thou art his son, thou art the king. As long as there are other allies whom can be targeted, the select librarian will not be targeted for attacks. If this card is alive at the end of the reception, resolve an additional book for every guest defeated. Oh. That's nice. <laughs> I like extra books. That's nice for farming books, it really is. Divine power, be not, be not frightened, I am the savior and shall be with thee. While this character is alive, all other allies gain two protection each scene. If this character has used White Knight's Ego Page, allies also absorb instances of three or less damage. Uh, interesting. 
So they don't get damage if damage 3 is less. Apostles. Have not I chosen you 12? Now rise, my servant, rise and serve me. 12, so this is Christianity? Really? Or is there some other religion with 12 apostles? Maybe there are. While this character is alive, all other allies, or maybe it's changed to 12 just for the English? Nah, yeah, whatever. While this character is alive, all other allies deal plus 2 to 7 damage with attacks. If the character has used baptism 12 or more times this reception, all allies also gain plus 1 power. Interesting. That's really interesting. Ego pages. Heaven. On hit, seal a speed die of target next scene. I like that. I like sealing dice. Because that's a really good way to make bosses uh, weaker. Dead silence. On use, gain a speed die for the next scene. Destroy opponents next die. Clash win. Uh, yeah, that's good. We get an extra die. I like that. <laughs> Mass summation, sound of a storm, hit. If user stagger assist above 50%, deal 10 damage and stagger damage. Okay. Mass individual, on use. All allies record 15 HP and stagger assist. I like healing. I like this one. Penitence. Now oh, this is the card we played in the end to win. And finally, Paradise Lost. That's what we were fighting. Synchronize with the White Knight for the next three scenes. All other allies transform into apostles while the synchronization is active. The apostles cannot be controlled or defeated. If an apostle HP falls to 1, they cannot act until the synchronization is disengaged. The apostles just transform back into librarian once the synchronization is disengaged. Ah, oh, we have to try this at least once, right? Okay, cool. That's really cool. So we turn into the White Knight. Cool. So yeah, uh, that's uh, that's the full realization of Kokma. Really sorry that I kind of, well my PC or my program messed it up, doesn't really matter. So I did it twice, just so you can see the end. And yeah, uh, there was some loss there. You didn't see my legit uh, re uh, uh, reactions to what was going on. But uh, all in all, there was nothing really special. It was kind of an easy fight, so yeah. Anyhow, uh, on my first rec playthrough, I, I was really worried that I was left with Hokma having Nikolai, and my comment was like, wait, what? Is Nikolai strong enough for this? Can we solo what's left with Nikolai? And I was super worried, and then the, the fight was done, so you didn't miss much. Anyhow, that's gonna be it for this episode. Uh, hope you like it. So we got some stories here we can read, and we can, uh, yeah. So maybe we do a chilly episode, we'll see. Reading these, I'll have to decide what I'll do next. Uh, we also have some nice invitations I really wanna do. Like this one here, go a little bit more against Hana. But yeah, I had lots of fun today. Uh, <laughs> did this twice just to make two videos. Oh well, what can you do? Anyhow, if you're enjoying my playthrough of Library of Ruina, please like and subscribe. In the meantime, I wish you all to have a wonderful day. Do something nice. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you in the next episode. The Neomar signing out.